Indian Institute of Science in Bengaluru, India, are developing a vaccine that could be very effective in fighting the new variants of COVID-19. Scientists are working at IISC's Molecular Biophysics Unit say that they have identified molecules that could potentially be very useful in combating the pandemic. They claim their vaccine produces a high level of antibodies, much higher than the vaccines that are currently in use. In the trials concluded on animals, the molecules developed almost eight times the amount of antibodies that are developed in recently recovered patients of COVID-19. This vaccine is also more suited to Indian conditions because it is a warm vaccine, which can be stored at room temperature. The vaccines in use currently require elaborate cold storage chains and could see more wastage if there isn't sufficient facility for that. Professor Raghavan Varadarajan, who is a professor of molecular physics at IISC, was working on an influenza vaccine for the last four years, but shifted focus to work on a vaccine against the coronavirus last year. But clinical development alone could take about six months, while human trial, trials after that could take about another four months. It could still take a year before the vaccine is available in the market. We were earlier joined by Raghavan Varadarajan, professor at Indian Institute of Science, giving us more insights on this. Let's listen in. So what we found is that when we lyophilize the protein, it remains stable to high temperatures for extended periods of time. So in, in that condition, uh, it can be transported and stored without difficulty. And then just before uh, addition, it would, uh, before vaccination, it would have to be resolubilized. It's impossible to comment about all future variants. All I can comment is the present variants that we have. And so we have tested the immune sera against uh, a variant from South Africa, which is, has caused considerable decreases in vaccine efficacy. And uh, the sera that we have elicited are able to well neutralize this particular variant. And we are in the process of testing it against other variants, including the one circulating in India. So I expect we will certainly uh, be able to, to do reasonably well. And we can all, you know, by the time the vaccine is ready to be uh, uh, put into use, there may be new variants, and we can incorporate those fairly rapidly into our formulation as required. 